Greetings, history enthusiasts! Welcome back to our channel, where we delve into the fascinating stories of the past. Today, we embark on a journey through time to explore one of the most captivating chapters in human history, the rise and fall of the mighty Roman Empire. In this video, we will focus on a critical aspect that ultimately led to Rome's demise, the Empire's Achilles' heel, the causes and consequences of Rome's downfall. For centuries, the Roman Empire stood as a symbol of power, grandeur, and unparalleled achievements. Its legions conquered vast territories, its culture left an indelible mark on the world, and its governance provided a blueprint for future civilizations. But like all great empires, Rome faced challenges that ultimately brought about its collapse. One of the foremost causes of Rome's downfall was its ambitious expansion and subsequent inability to effectively govern such an extensive domain. As the empire grew, so did the strain on its administration, communication, and ability to maintain control over distant regions. Corruption, inefficiency, and a decline in leadership quality plagued the central government, sowing the seeds of its own downfall. Another crucial factor contributing to Rome's fall was the gradual weakening of its military might. Once renowned for their strength and discipline, the Roman legions began to falter. The recruitment of non-Roman mercenaries diluted the loyalty and effectiveness of the military, resulting in internal divisions and conflicts within the empire itself. The economic stability that had sustained Rome for centuries also eroded over time. Reliant on conquests and the acquisition of new territories to fuel its economy, Rome faced economic challenges as its expansion slowed and resources dwindled. Widespread use of slave labor displaced free workers and led to social unrest. Mismanagement of finances and rampant inflation further weakened the empire's economic foundations. Political instability and corruption were rampant within the Roman Empire, intensifying its decline. Succession crises, power struggles, and political assassinations cast a shadow over the empire's governance. Emperors often rose to power through military coups, resulting in frequent changes in leadership and a lack of stability, a vulnerability that external forces would exploit. Externally, Rome faced relentless onslaughts from invading barbarian tribes and rival powers. In the late 4th and 5th centuries, Germanic tribes like the Visigoths, Ostrogoths, and Vandals launched major invasions, capitalizing on the empire's internal weaknesses. These external threats proved to be the final blow that brought Rome to its knees. The consequences of Rome's downfall were profound and far-reaching. The collapse of the Western Roman Empire in 476 CE marked the end of an era and set in motion a period of profound political, social, and economic transformation throughout Europe. The fall of Rome shaped the course of history, paving the way for new powers to rise and ushering in a transition from classical antiquity to the Middle Ages. Join us on this captivating journey as we uncover the intricacies of Rome's downfall, exploring its Achilles' heel the causes and consequences that forever change the course of civilization. So, buckle up and let's dive into the captivating story of the empires. The Roman Empire, once a formidable force that dominated much of the known world, eventually crumbled under its own weight, beset by a myriad of internal and external pressures. While Rome's fall was a complex event with various contributing factors, it is possible to identify a crucial weakness that plagued the empire throughout its decline, the empire's Achilles' heel, so to speak. One of the primary causes of Rome's downfall was its overextension and subsequent inability to effectively govern such a vast territory. At its height, the Roman Empire encompassed a vast expanse of land, stretching from modern-day Britain in the northwest to the Euphrates River in the east and Egypt in the south. The sheer size of the empire posed significant challenges in terms of administration, communication, and maintaining control over far-flung regions. As the empire expanded, the central government struggled to maintain effective governance, leading to increased corruption, inefficiency, and a decline in the quality of leadership. Furthermore, Rome's military, once renowned for its strength and discipline, began to weaken over time. The legions that had once secured victory after victory became less effective due to a variety of factors. One crucial factor was the recruitment of non-Roman mercenaries into the army, who lacked the same level of loyalty and discipline as their Roman counterparts. 
This not only diminished the effectiveness of the military, but also contributed to internal divisions and conflicts within the empire. Economic instability also played a significant role in Rome's decline. As the empire expanded, it relied heavily on conquests and the acquisition of new territories to sustain its economy. However, as these conquests slowed down and resources became scarcer, Rome faced economic challenges. The widespread use of slave labor also had negative consequences, as it displaced free workers and created social unrest. Additionally, the government's mismanagement of finances and rampant inflation further weakened the economic foundations of the empire. The political instability and corruption within the Roman Empire were deeply intertwined with its downfall. Succession crises, power struggles, and political assassinations were rampant during this period. Emperors often ascended to power through military coups rather than a clear line of succession, leading to frequent changes in leadership and a lack of stability. This political chaos weakened the empire and made it susceptible to external threats. Externally, the Roman Empire faced numerous challenges from invading barbarian tribes and rival powers. In the late 4th and 5th centuries, Germanic tribes such as the Visigoths, Ostrogoths, and Vandals launched significant invasions into Roman territory, putting immense strain on the empire's defenses. While these tribes were not the sole reason for Rome's fall, they took advantage of the empire's internal weaknesses and contributed to its eventual collapse. The consequences of Rome's downfall were far-reaching and enduring. The fall of the Western Roman Empire in 476 CE marked the end of ancient Rome and triggered a period of significant political, social, and economic upheaval throughout Europe. The vacuum left by Rome's collapse allowed new powers to rise, such as the Byzantine Empire in the East and various Germanic kingdoms in the West. The fall of Rome also had profound cultural implications, as it marked the transition from classical antiquity to the Middle Ages. Rome's downfall can be attributed to a combination of factors, including overextension, military decline, economic instability, political corruption, and external threats. The empire's Achilles' heel was its inability to effectively govern and maintain control over its vast territories, leading to internal decay and vulnerability to external pressures. The consequences of Rome's fall were significant and shaped the course of history in Europe for centuries to come.